Hey, what's up guys? Sean Gaming here. Today we are back on the road to Mutt Master. We are doing the dolphin set for, I think it's Oliver Vernon. Or Olivier Vernon. I don't know how you pronounce his first name. We got a couple things to buy. Hopefully we can find a couple cards really cheap. From what it looks like, this set's going to cost me, I don't know, 90k? Maybe? And the card goes for 80k? So, yeah, as you can see, it's 80k. But I'm going to try... I don't know if I want to overprice it, because so far, the Dominic Carter's commodity, I ended up selling it for 200 when at the time it was going for like, um, like 180. So I actually got a lot more out of that card than I expected. Then... Uh, we got another set that we got done that I'll show you guys in just a little bit. It's by this Brent Grimes. Hopefully he doesn't go for too much. Sweet, 2,500. The main thing with these sets, it's not that I, I'm willing to lose the coins, but I'm willing to lose a little bit. I don't want to lose like 100k on a set. That's not worth it. That's why I'm doing like sets that I'm almost done with or I already know that there's nothing really pricey in there and the car just doesn't even go for anything either so it's simple to do but for like uh, some of the sets they had like a hundred K player in there so if the player doesn't go for a hundred K then I'm not gonna do that set until that player drops that's why I was willing to do the Giants set uh, we'll just go ahead and buy this guys Remember, I sniped this guy for like 8k at once, but I sold him back because I wanted the coins. Should have held on to him. And one of the very last players. 36k, that's a good buy. And now two elite badges. Okay, yeah, I forgot to count. I forgot to put in the elite badges, so it's gonna cost me a little bit more than I expected, but I'm not losing too much. That's that's the main goal: not lose a whole lot. If anything, I just don't want to lose more than 50k. That's it. 50k is that? That's a good. That's a good amount of coins. At least uh, I know the payout will be worth it once we're done with it. Alright, there we go. So, last we got everything bought. Yep, alright, let's right, start adding everything. That'll be another, another set closer to being done. Rashad Jones. All right, there we go, 15K, and we get the Olivier Vernon, how do you want to pronounce that? Also, it's let me add it to a set from here. And we'll put him up for one hour and see if I can squeeze out 90K. I, li I like to get 90 out of him. If he doesn't sell, then I'll just put it back up for 80. And let's go over the set that I already got done. So there's this set done. And what? where's the other set? Oh, here we go. We got the Cardinals done. The only person that really blew my coins was Ted Larson. He cost me about 100k and then the Elite Badges 40k together. I doubt this set's pretty cheap. Nothing really, nothing costs coins in here. <clears throat> but... So let's see. Wait, wait, wait. Before we end this video, let's see what's going to be the next set that I try to get done. I know the cheapest captain is um, Matthew Stafford. I'm going to look at his set right now. I don't see anybody that looks like they cost a lot of coins. Yeah, all these guys look cheap. Let's just look at the kicker and the punter real quick. They'll this uh, Matthew Stafford set will probably be the next video yeah so I think doing the Matthew Stafford set looking at all these cars I don't see anything that's gonna go for anything period we should only lose like I don't know 10k 10 20k so like I said that's worth it 
But anyways, guys, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.